Hey guys! So today I made a big change and if you're new to my channel you probably have no idea what I'm talking about but if you have watched my channel for any amount of time you can tell I cut my hair. I just reached for it and it wasn't there because it's so short. Um, I am not a courageous person when it comes to my look. I like the tried and true. I like the known and especially with my hair because it grows pretty slowly once I found my groove in like 10th grade, I kept getting the same haircut from the same hairdresser and when I moved for school, I just tried to have every hairdresser replicate that same haircut and then I would go home and I would have my normal hairdresser redo it. Um, and I finally just got tired of it and I decided that I really wanted to make a change. I wanted to update my look. I wanted to age my look a little bit and just try something new. So I went for a lob, which is a long bob, and in this video I'm kind of just going to give you the story about what made me decide to cut my hair, what sort of inspiration pictures I looked at, um, and what I asked for in my haircut, so that if you're interested in replicating this style, you can, and if you're not, then you have a little background about why I decided to cut it. So, so before you leave, if you're not interested in this video, at least leave a comment what you at least leave a comment in the bottom bar below telling me what you think. Um, I'm curious to know your opinion. If you say mean things, I'll cry. Um, no, I'm just kidding. But I, I am genuinely curious to see what you guys think because it's definitely a different look. And if you don't know what my hair normally looks like or used to look like, go check back on old videos because um, obviously it's there. Okay, so let's just first start with the story of how I decided to get my hair cut. So like I said, I've always had pretty long hair. I always do long layers. And I just really started feeling like I wanted something that made me look a little bit older that was a little bit more professional since I will be in turning it at an investment bank this summer and I really wanted to update my look because I hadn't done anything to my hair in like five or six years so it was time it was time so I think my first inspiration came from Khloe Kardashian which is like really random and weird I was watching Keeping Up with the Kardashians and she got that like lob at the beginning of this last season and I was just like that's really cool that looks really good on her I didn't think it was gonna be for me but the more I looked on the internet and the more I looked on Pinterest I just kept seeing this hairstyle pop up and then this weekend I was at Donnie's and I just started really looking at them and I showed it to him and I was like what do you think do you think I could do it and he was like, yeah, like I, I you know, if you want to do it, go for it. So that's kind of what reignited that interest. And then yesterday uh, was Monday and I came back from my weekend with Donnie and I told my roommate that I really wanted to get my hair cut short and she has a kind of similar haircut and was like, do it, you should do it. And I looked at photos all night. I compiled a bunch of different photos that I really liked of different cuts that were pretty similar to this to bring in. I texted like 20 different people asking them if they thought this would look good on me, asking their opinion. And then, and this is what sealed the deal for me, I took my hair and I just gathered it into like a low pony with just my hands and then I flipped the ends under and just pinned it with bobby pins to the nape of my neck and then kind of brought the hair out and forward to give it like a faux bob. I'll insert a picture right here. And I did it and looked at it from the front and from the side and I thought it just really complimented my face and I thought it wasn't something that was going to look horrible on me. So it was nice to kind of have that as a... Uh, as kind of a mock-up, just to, just to feel it out. So if you're interested in the salon, um, it's a chain in Chicago. It's called Art and Science, and I went to the one in Evanston. And the woman who cut my hair's name was Leanne, and she was amazing. She had a very similar haircut, which was great, because I walked in and was like, you have it. I just that. Plus, let me show you these pictures. Um, but that's always really, really great when your stylist has a haircut you're going for. And she was so nice and personable and just did such an amazing job and talked me through the whole thing. And um, I highly, highly recommend her if you guys are looking for a great stylist in Evanston. Um, so basically, I went into the salon this evening with my like 10 or 15 photos. I'm going to have them all linked below in case you want to bring in the same photos. I'll also have photos of the haircut that she took herself right after she did it. Mind you, it's not how I styled it right now. Um, I'm going to do a video very soon about how I styled it because I think this is a very cute way to style it. I really like how this turned out. She did it a lot more spunky, a lot less curly, um, and just a lot more kind of organic looking, and that was not really my style. Um, but once I came home and I styled it, I was like, yes, I love it. Um, so yeah, uh, mind you that the photos are her styling, not mine, um, so it won't look exactly the same as this, but it's the same haircut. So after I showed her the photos, she went ahead and shampooed and conditioned my hair, and then she went through and just like cut off the length first, 
And then she actually blow dried my hair, straightened the ends a little bit, and did the rest of the cut with dry hair, which is something that I never had happen before, but she reassured me that that was how she did it, and I was totally trusting of her. And I'm not a hairdresser, so I can't tell you exactly what she did, but basically, the thing she was explaining to me is that since I already had long layers, she didn't want to give me more layers. She thought they were plenty short. She thought that what it was already looked great. Um, so what she did is she was pulling out pieces of hair and cutting up with the scissors into the, the ends of the hair to kind of give it a little bit more texture. Um, and to kind of lighten up the end so it's not so heavy and so it's not just like a blunt cut because I wanted something that was a little bit more natural looking. So that was kind of my big takeaway of how she cut it. I don't know what that's called. If any of you guys are hairstylists, feel free to like leave comments in the bottom bar below. But I think the best thing you can do is bring in inspiration photos showing them what you want. Um, and yeah, I just basically told her that I wanted a lob haircut. So that is kind of the overview of what I did. Um, I really, really like it. I think it is really fresh, really cute. And really quick, I'll give you a couple different angles of it just so you can kind of see it from all the way around. So here we have the front. Then from the side. And then the back. So that is a little bit of an overview. It's really, really different, and I am definitely taking a sec to get used to it. I I have moments where I just kind of step back and think to myself, what did you do? You just cut off all of your long, beautiful hair that took you quite a while to grow. But um, the truth of the matter was, it was long, but it was really dead. And this feels so healthy, and I just know that it really, really needed this. So... I don't know how long I'm going to keep this haircut. I may end up growing it out very soon, um, but I'm thinking it will probably stick around through my internship because I, I, it's really growing on me. The more I look at it, the more, the more I like it. So yeah, I don't know. I just want to share that with you. I didn't really have a video coming into today, and when I decided I was going to do this last night, I was like, great, I'm just going to share with them my experience. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was kind of short and rambly, but I just thought it'd be fun to touch base with you guys a little bit and share with you what I did to my hair. So I'm going to have before and after photos and a whole blog post down on my blog. So if you want to check it out, I'm going to have that linked in the bottom bar below so you can go check that out. Um, as well as check out all of my other social media. I have Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, Instagram. I'm really getting back into the Instagram thing. I'm really trying to work on my theme. So yeah, look out for some cute photos. And we have date night tomorrow for a fee. So I think I'm going to try to at least do some outfits of the day for that or outfits of the night and maybe makeup. I don't know. I'm not exactly sure how that video is going to come out, but hopefully that will come up to you guys on Thursday. And yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are having a great evening and I'm really excited about my hair. Let me know what you think in the comments below, um, good or bad. I'm curious to hear what you guys think, just because it is such a drastic change, but I think, I think it's cute. I, I'm excited to see what Donnie has to say, because he has never seen me with short hair. I've never seen me with short hair. So, new look for me, but I hope you guys like this video, like my new hair, and yeah, I will see you guys on Thursday. Bye, guys.